morning, it's Lee Kale. Welcome to Journal Thursdays. We're going to start doing Journal Thursdays, I believe, because I feel like it. I think it would be a good thing to do. I need to start art journaling more in my beautiful handmade art journal. Um, there is a video of this art journal that I made, which you can see on my playlist in the art journal section. Uh, I'm going to use my flamingo pad when I stamp this flower stamp. I'm using, I feel like using water media today. So, uh, I'm going to stamp this image. This is the image, my inspiration image, by Karen Hazelden. Um, it's a Stampotique stamp, S-T-A-M-P-O-T-I-Q-U-E. Um, I love their stamps. They are fabulous. They have a lot of funky things, and I love them for that. One of my favorite, um, they have two artists that design for them, Kate Crane and Fran France Papillon. And I love both of their works, but this is uh, Kay Hazelden. And then they have this fabulous pink flamingo, uh, which I have used before. Okay, so I want this about right here, I'm thinking. I have two sentiment stamps that I believe I want to use on this page. There's a whole world outside your comfort zone. And when I grow up, I want to be me. The reason why I'm using stays on ink is because it is not a water soluble ink. It is alcohol based. Therefore, if I use water media on this, such as watercolor pencils, which I have my Karan Dash watercolor pencils, which I have not used very much, but I'm looking forward to exploring. And I also am looking forward to playing with today my Distressed Crayons from Ted, uh, Tim Holtz. Did I say Ted? Why did I say Ted? Tim Holtz. I think that should be good enough. That'll work. A little faint but we can work with that I'm not the best stamper in the world cheers I got my coffee and I'm happy my plan for this page it I'm feeling very spring spring like right now I did some gardening earlier this week pulling weeds and enjoy doing that and one of the things I want to explore today is working on faces it's something that I'm not used to drawing and it's something that I'd like to explore more so what I'm gonna do is look for somewhat of a flesh tony yeah that's kind of peachy um, color here, even lighter. Yeah, that's more in line with me. Um, because I'm gonna be drawing me looking at a flower. Yeah. Okay. So, kind of, sort of. So this is the flower I'm gonna look up at. And when you're drawing a face, you draw an oval. Well, I have a kind of an oval type face, and this is. Uh, we're looking down and I'm doing this faintly because I'm trying to get the way I want it to be right here yeah I want it right here now you see since I'm using a watercolor pencil this will all blend in and I can do layer upon layer upon layer. And what I could have done first is actually put a layer of clear gesso down to protect the paper even more. But I didn't feel like it because I'm just playing. And this is what I feel like doing. So I got a, my basic shape of my face because I got a kind of round face. Now, when you're making a face, 
<laughs> a lot of people when they're drawing faces initially their tendency is to put the eyes way up here but that's not correct actually <laughs> your eyes go at the halfway point it seems weird but that's where they go so I got an eye here and an eye here about halfway and then halfway between the eyes with the little eye center about right here um halfway between the eye and the chin which give me a little pointy chin okay because I'm looking at Halfway between here and here is my nose. Okay? Give me a little nose. Little nose. Okay, and then halfway between my nose and here, I have a happy mouth. Okay? And then the rest is hair. Coming down, swooping down. I know, it looks like a pig nose. I gave myself a pig nose. Look at that. But it'll be fixed. Don't worry. The neck comes down out of the head from under the eyes. And we give some shoulders. Tell me why you want the shoulders to be up. Look, you see, I'm crooked. I am a very bad drawer. I did get a minor in studio art. I don't know how. No, I know how. It was photography. <laughs> but I can't really draw it all that well, as you will see. I'm not a very realistic drawer. But, you know what? That's okay, because...
<clears throat> okay, so I've piddled with this long enough. I, at one point you saw, I put some white gesso and then some heavy white gesso and then some clear gesso on the face because I was not happy with the way it turned out. And now I'm a bit more happy with the way it turned out, so I'm just going to leave it. And I think I'm going to stamp this right here. I'm still not totally pleased, but I am learning faces. So, you know, when you think you reach a point where, you know, like, it, 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 it stop, just stop, then you just stop. And that's what I'm doing. I am stopping. There is a whole world outside your comfort zone. Where is my, this is my favorite one. When I grow up, I want to be me. And today is May the, oh God, this is still in October. That's how long it's been. Mm -mm -mm. May the what, what, May, May what? Oh goodness gracious, I'm so lost. May the 11th. Hmm. I like to put the date in 2017. Hmm. I like to put the date on my journal page, which I haven't been doing, with remember this on it. So I don't know what I was thinking on that day and what I was doing. So there you go. Remember this. Let me zoom you in. So that you can see exactly, 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 exactly. Are you getting this? Tight, tight, tight. Come on, come on. Tighten in. There you go. There you go. That's what I did. I'm getting better at faces. I used to be really bad. So, there's a whole world outside your comfort zone. Remember that. Remember that. I try to remember that. And always know, when I want to grow up, I want to be me. I never wanted to be anybody else. How about you? How about you? If you... Enough about me. Let's talk about you. What do you think about me? If you like what I'm doing, give me a thumbs up and come back and make the video with me again. That me, that's Cajun for come visit with me again and see my videos and hopefully we'll do more <laughs> journal Thursdays. I think this will be fun. And we can explore different media and uh, different things and we can have fun together. And I hope you have a fabulous day. Subscribe to my videos. Give me a thumbs up in the corner. And watch my other videos. I think you'll like them if this is the first one that you're seeing. And if this isn't the first one, I'm so glad you came back. Yay!